Well guys, going up to Waller Crag, but that's skiddy there, what you're looking at there. Glorious day here, just above Keswick. Uh, big, big, big day for UK. Are we in, are we out? Are we in, are we out of the U EU? But who bloody cares? Who cares of stuff that we can do anyway, if you're in or out? <laughs> anyway. I'm sick of hearing about it to be honest. I'm off up there and hopefully I'm going to do uh, a wild camp at Bleaberry Fell, 2,000 feet. Anyway, oh, lovely day it is today. Warm, sunny, grand. I'll have to have a, a dip down there because it's warm work now. That's it for now. Yeah, that trekking pole. I had to go back. 150 meters because I left it behind, didn't I? Down there somewhere, but I got it. Being from Yorkshire, I'm not bloody tight, so I had to go back. <laughs> yeah, June the 23rd. Yeah, it's been a funny sort of day. Been a funny old day, but they say things comes in twos and threes. Anyway, that's where I camped back in uh, back in yeah back in September last year. I would, I would definitely recommend camping there. Yeah, that's Waller there. Well, guys. Taking no notice of the date on here. Date's all wrong. Yeah, it's actually the 23rd of uh, June. Um, I'm bidding, first time ever. But I forgot it. I've got, I forgot my pegs, I've forgotten my paracord, so I'll have to make do popping the hoop up with uh, my uh, walking pole. Yeah. So here I am. I'm camping here where I camped back in September. Um, so I just like it better. Views are better. I mean, I've been up up uh, up to Bleaberry there. I've been there about half an hour ago, but it's kind of featureless up there. And I've, and I've camped here. Well, if you have, if you've seen me uh, while camp September last year. Um, Anyway, yeah, first time ever bivying. So we'll see what it turns out like. The return. Yeah. Always make sure, double check the day you go wild camping, because, you know, luckily the week's not too bad. If it was windy, I would be struggling to, uh, you know, pin my bivy hoop down. But yeah, lesson learned. So anyway, I've had uh, I've had my tea about a couple of hours ago with Alan in Keswick, where we're staying out in the South Caving apartment. Yeah, so uh, that's that's it for the moment. It's uh, it's quite chilly now. I mean, I'm, I'm below two thousand feet. Um, in the valleys coming up it was really warm but the temperature obviously I think every few hundred metres you climb you, I think you lose two or three degrees anyway so uh, yeah well guys ten past nine I'm having a cup of hot jockey that's my bivy set up I've rearranged my uh, walking pole to the centre at Hoop God for the old um, gaffer booked in. Too bad now that. So that's a bit more secure. Wind's got up a bit. Yeah, it has. Just below. I'd say I was about at 500 
uh, four, four, five hundred metres. It's definitely a bit of a chill in the air. But yeah, I'm just recording the time lapse. bivy now. I tell you what, I'm really I'm really liking this because you know you can sort of I've got the netting up. You can still see see the sky and look out. Oh cool. Well I suppose you could do the same in a tent, just keep your door open or something, couldn't you? But first time I've ever bivied, I think I'm gonna like it. Okay I am you know You can still look out the view, I mean it's half ten. Anyway, good night. <laughs>